Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Creeper World 4. That is right, we are back heading into the colony section yet again for another colonies map. That's right, we are going for the final stand. Wanna do a do a wanna do a cursor map, you know, just a little cursor style. Seems like it'd be fun. Uh lots of rooms, lots of shields. We'll probably be time stewing it, not worrying about time, just trying to sort of cursor our way to victory, you know, just a pure cursor. Seems like fun. Looking forward to it, and there is a lot going on, of course. Uh the human have retreated to their final stronghold on this planet. We must make them pay for what they have done to us. Eradication is the only answer. It'll be this will be a long, hard fight since they are so well fortified. Uh, so the Creeper Queen has given you everything at her disposal. That is right. Uh, oh, okay. I didn't even realize we had eggs on this one. I thought it was just going to be a cursor map. Uh, so we do have eggs. We have mesh. We have all sorts of things. And that's going to be pretty wild. So we even have... We can up... Ooh. This changes a whole lot. Um, oh. Oh, my. Now I have the option of cheating, right? Because we can just drop, like, an egg over here and boom, you're over the wall, right? Uh, same thing. You come down here, you drop an egg over here, boom, you're over the wall, boom, you're over the wall, boom, you're over the wall, and then you're in the final area, right? Ooh, this is... This is, uh, tricky. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna say, just for rule's sake, if there is a purple wall, we are not allowed to go through it. This is a, this is a personal thing. We are not allowed to go through purple walls. Because, I mean, those, the, let's, let's, you know, they block everything. They're supposed to block us, right? So this is the intended route. Now, blue walls, we can egg over because we can get through them. So that is my personal rule. Uh, it will probably greatly increase my time from what I could get. Uh, because, I mean, I already am like, wow, we could just take out all of that. Uh, get to the end of here and just start hopping around and doing all sorts of stuff. And honestly, you could go all the way up here. You could get to up here probably before any AC makes it up here. So, I mean, yeah, you can, you can do quite a lot. But we're not going to do it. We're not hopping over any purple walls. There we go. I am going to turn on the map indicator because it is a cursor map. We do have, again, we have eggs and mesh and all sorts of good stuff, but let's get going and see how things progress, of course. So, so yeah, just going to just gonna be uh, nice, light, and easy. Whoa, come on, moving along, moving along. Oh, we had the initial five seconds of Breeder, of course. That's why it was so fast. Oh, we are so weak right now. We're weak like little baby. And I am so tempted to just drop an egg. You have no idea. I just see him like... Look at all those airs, aircrafts that are just, like, begging for it, right? They're literally there. All you need to do is just put it to them. But you know what? We're not going to. We're going to do it right. Uh, but again, we can drop over shielded areas, of course. So that does mean we can also do some shenanigans. You know, a wee little bit. Maybe not, maybe not as much as I would like, of course. But the shenanigans will happen. The shenanigans will happen. Uh, so, for instance, like right here, we've just made it to here. As long as we can... S Ooh, don't blow me up. Let me make it. I want to be safe. Oh, keep it going. Keep it going. Get to the safety. Okay. So, we... Di uh, ooh. Okay. We made it past them. We're safe here. And you know what? We're safe here. We're going to be attacking this wall. That's what we would be doing. So we can attack this wall freely. So you know what? Boom. Egg on the other side. Because, again, that's that's what we would be doing. So we will just grab some power because it's free. Unfortunately, that's all we're going to be doing with this right now. Just grabbing some power. Hopefully uh, that'll spread up nice and nice. There we go. There's the power we were looking for. Much nicer. But again, we're not going to egg over this wall. I <laughs> really, really want to. Now, that being said... Ooh, this is... And we are not yet fully fully powered up. Let's get fully powered up, right? Definitely going to want to do that. Again, free power, free real estate. It'll only take a second, because the plan right now is to do something a little tricky, right? And it is within the lines, I'm saying, right? Because now we're going through this wall. We're actually fairly stable in this corner. I'm just making sure we're stable. It looks like we are. So we are stable here. We will be able to break through this. And if we drop an egg, we can drop an egg here, and it will pop because of our creep over here. It's not going to... It would... I mean, it's going to pop because of this as well, but our creep here is within range to pop it. So that's why I'm saying that egg is allowed. So it's over a blue wall. 
Uh, let's see. Pop, 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 pop. And it did make creep. Glorious. That's what we wanted to see. Oh my, oh my. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, so there we go. We have just jumped ship just a wee little bit. Uh, you know, I think I think that's within a reasonable tactic, a reasonable way to do things. Uh, so let's uh, let's cut this area off from some power and see. Now we're here. And guess what that means? Oh, that's right. We are we are now at a blue shield attacking it. And yeah, we're going straight for some aircrafts, no doubt. Easy peasy. Get my butt over here. Beautiful. I mean, I, I guess just for the sake of you know appearances, let's uh, just destroy all of these. So if the uh, spore launcher does shoot, it gets to uh, gets to shoot all at once, right? Destroy everything in there. Glorious. And yeah, let's let's get rid of some of these bad boys, right? Hey, we freed the we freed our first friendo, and that is always always a good sign. And look at that. There goes all of the air force. Just what we want to see. Again, we are not going over the top. It is unfortunate. But again, that's that's the the rule that I'm kind of setting. Uh, when's that going to launch? It's going to launch in a wee bit, so it's not launching anytime soon, unfortunately. But I guess that means we can uh, try and free our other friend over here, right? Let's let's get a friend. Uh, definitely want to get this nullifier down, get the shield down as well, of course. And then, yeah, I think uh, I think we're gonna be in a much better state. Look at that nullifier down, friendo online, and I think I want. Ooh, actually, you know what? Launchers. Does that reduce the timer? No, it does not. Let's go with a couple of them, right? 19, 20. Oh, they might be random. Okay, if they're random, I don't want it anymore, right? So we'll we'll leave it there. And now the question is. Actually, how many blobs are here? Three? I was gonna, I was gonna cut more blobs too, right? Well, why not? Uh, ooh, let's also cut them off from power, of course. No one likes these canons. So, yeah, just, just easy peasy. Done. Again, all of these are done, thankfully. And yeah, we're, we're pretty stable. Do need to get some creep elsewhere there. Now, that being said, if creep does land elsewhere, for instance, if these launch and land in here, well, then we're golden, right? We don't even need to do this section. It's just, I mean, it'll, it'll die eventually, of course. Uh, but I'd rather not use my eggs yet to get through there. But we shall see. It might be an egg trail, and if it is an egg trail, it will be an honest egg trail. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna cheese it and be like, well, jump over walls. Now we would have to start here and egg trail around. Fingers crossed. We don't have to do that, but we shall see. Uh, do we even need that mesh? Not really. We don't really need anything. I'm just trying to take. I'm just trying to take the rest of the land so we have land, right? Uh, what's over here though? There's another blob nest. I definitely want to grab that blob nest, and I definitely want this emitter. I th honestly, I think this emitter is going to be the big one because it's sort of like our forward emitter. Uh, doesn't look. Ooh, but there's one over there. I didn't. Even, oh, I didn't even realize that one. See, I am a fool. And look at this AC pouring out, right? If we had just gone straight for it, we'd have probably had like a wall here already. But mm. you know, you can only do so much. 22 seconds. They actually destroyed way more of the creeper than I thought. I thought they would have died ages ago. But that's okay. 20 seconds. Let's see where these spores fire. So, fingers crossed it will be someplace good. Let's turn up the speed just a little bit. Turn it back down because, you know, it, it is slightly problematic at times. You know, let's try and help this mesh too because uh, we can usually spread mesh, I think, faster if we move it. I don't know. Maybe it's not. Maybe it just... All right, where are you going? All right, so it is random, and looks like we're landing in here. So you know what? We can actually we can oh end in here. Okay, so we're landing in a few interesting places. So yeah, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be good, I think. Uh, are we landing? All right, that is getting shot down. Yeah, I don't see any air defense over on this side though. So this is this is exciting. Uh, let us grab. I guess this one to start. Bazinga. Make sure it doesn't die right up. Oh, wow, look at that. That one literally landed uh, on the sheet. 
That's pretty wild. But let's grab our friend though, that we've already beefed up a little bit. Get that going, of course. And now, look at this. And you know what? Just for the sake of doing it, I'm going to pop an egg just on this side, right? Because, you know, if that can just spread, might as well just make it spread, right? Uh, also, we can grab those blobs as well. And this is just free real estate in essence, right? Uh, we'll get rid of this Amrift. Maybe that'll turn off the area, which would be kind of cool. And then we just have free real estate. And I, I will. Yeah, turned off the entire area. Free real estate. Easy peasy. And we have a big boy emitter over here. So, yeah, we're, we're feeling pretty okay at the moment. Uh, not too bad at all. <laughs> you know, and again, I'm doing this with, with my own rules. It's within the rules. Uh, maybe the rules are silly. Uh, and I apologize. You know, it's not, it's not the most optimal to follow these rules. But... It does work. So again, uh, as long as we are stable at a shield, which this is stable at a shield, we can see. I mean, we're at the shield. Everything is shooting us, but we are stable here. So you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna try and uh, circumvent that a little bit. You know, let's just toss a couple down behind, behind the lines. And yeah, as long as, as long as we're stable at that shield, it's still working through. I feel very confident that this is okay because you know. We, we have the tools at our disposal. I mean, works for me, if, if you ask me. Uh, and this might be exactly what we needed, right? Because now we're on this side. Uh, yes, I will admit, we did lose the, uh, the shield to a degree. But this is what I wanted to say. Get rid of that M rift. Get out of here. I mean, our, our production is also very substantial, which is fantastic. Uh, ooh, they are launching a couple of Rockets, though, so I wonder what that's going to do. I wonder how they're going to use Rockets against us. I don't know. Uh, but let's uh, see, because will this turn off this block? Because if it will, that's just going to be awesome, right? Getting rid of this pylon, turning off another block. Ooh, maybe that would be good. Uh, let us see. Do we have it? Uh, it looks as though it did not. Interesting. Okay, so the the, can, the towers themselves can survive, which is good for them. Uh, we are getting shot over here, though. So the question is, do we want to worry about shutting this off? Which I kind of do, right? I kind of do in this regard. Although, you know what? Again, we can stably do this stable, and then we could just move through once the shield breaks. Or we can just move past it, which I think is the goal. And I'm going to use a bunch of creep just to... You know, we got we got a lot of eggs, so let's just use them. Ooh. Okay, so the creep on this side, way deeper. Or the AC on this side is way deeper. Holy moly. Uh, but that's okay, because you know what? We're on this side. We're stable. Uh, alive. And an M-Rift is gone. That is right. An M-Rift has fallen. Oh my, oh my. Just, just delays the uh, the amount that they are gonna do. Now the problem is, let's take it. Let's take a look at how deep this is. <laughs> yeah, that's deep. Okay, that explains quite a lot. Now, luckily, our creep down here is working, uh, and you know, what? just for the sake of things, you know, because we have a mesh, uh, let us just mesh on over to kind of like over here-ish. Uh, maybe not. No, you don't. You don't want. You're not deep enough. Is that really not deep enough? Jeez. Or can I not actually play Smash? It doesn't look like I can actually play Smash. Interesting. Okay. Okay. I, oh, but I can place it over here. Oh, now I can place it. But I can't... Oh, it's literally just not deep enough. It really seems like it should be. That is actually wild to me. Because I was planning on... Uh, I was going to do some mission. You know? Uh, yeah, it's just... It's oddly... Oddly meshed. Which is fine. Uh, this is going to break through on its own. Uh, this is slightly problematic. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to beef this up uh, quite a bit, right? Just to get a little bit of a, a home base established, if you will, right? Get some get some creep just sort of uh, to start draining this. Because my goal right now is actually to get through this mortar wall, right? I don't really care too much about the rest, but I think the mortar wall is what I want to get through. Now, why do I want to get through the mortar wall so bad? Well, I mean, other than the fact that it is a mortar wall. Oh, my. 
Yeah. Yeah, this is this is definitely slow. We definitely want more power, for sure. Uh, but I want to get to this, right? So if we can just do one on one of these. So, doot, doot, doot. Let's see how this works. Again, we're trying to do this honestly. Although I guess I could, since we are stable, drop an egg. Yeah, let's actually do that. Because we're not we're not going over any pink walls, so let's let's drop an egg here, here, and here, just to sort of chain up to this bad boy. Yeah, it's kind of my goal, and I think that would be a whole lot of goodness right there. Eggs. Ooh, oh my. So that creep is still there. And boop, 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 boop. Those all come down. Now the question is, can this actually get into the shield? Because if it can, I'm pretty content. All we need to do is literally get into this shield, into this emitter, and I think we're good. And that is that. This emitter is at 500. Oh no, it isn't. Oh no, it isn't. Now that's an emitter. 800? Yeah. And then. This blob nest is already set to 20. Okay, okay, yeah. Let's get it to 21 line as well. So now we're feeling comfortable, right? Uh, they did rebuild some stuff to back here, which is fine. Uh, I'm just gonna do this to take out the M-Rift again. I don't care about the rest, I just want the M-Rift because the next goal is to essentially shut off this area, right? Uh, I'm gonna let the emitter sort of uh, just start draining some stuff. Uh, because there's a there's a lot of AC over there, and that's gonna that's gonna be annoying. So we're gonna we're gonna just gonna move on in, take over some land. Not too bad. I don't really I don't really care if they get rockets. I suppose it really isn't gonna hinder me in any way. I mean, okay, they can drop a conversion. I suppose maybe they'll do that. I don't know. Uh, but we'll see. We shall see. And over here, let's take a look at the AC. We can see it was once very stable at like this height, and look at how much it's already drained from this side, right? It doesn't seem like it, but it's actually quite a bit. Quite a bit. So I am quite keen on that. And now, if we can, I'm gonna try and save my rocks, try and save my eggs, and, you know, at this point, because we do have some things fairly established on that. Let's uh, just get a bit more, because again, I mean, AC is still at over a million, right? So we, we got some time to kill. Oh, we're almost there. Yeah. Once these uh, cannons start... Ooh, that's, that was a nice set of blobs. Look at that. Once the cannons start to fall, it's going to be just all the good for us. Uh, the Emrift is rebuilt. It is. I do see that as well. Uh, but now that the cannons are falling, uh, the creep should... Oh, well, we want to get over there. Really bad to... Yeah, there's still so much AC. It's nuts! Is it dropping at all on the side? Not really, again. I'm actually pretty impressed with how much AC is still remaining in here with our, uh, supremely improved, uh, generation. So, again, I'm just gonna let, I'm just gonna let that do its thing. Uh, maybe, maybe, oh, that'll be good. If we can actually take the backside, although we can't, because those are super cannons. Uh, although we can jump over. Jumping over is allowed, that is for sure. I, I just want this to establish itself, you know, feel real good about itself. And we're taking out a side, right? We're eliminating the side pretty handily. Uh, I do want this to win as well, because if this starts to win, uh, then we can connect everything up. Uh, the mesh is now probably able to be put anywhere on the map, which would be grand. You know, for instance, if we were to mesh like this, still can't. I mean, that's just normal ground, right? Can we put there? It can't be... 
wild. I don't get it. I mean, I, I, mean, I see trees there. Maybe that is just some sort of special ground that I'm unaware of. Ooh, lots of spores. Because I, again, I also, I think that can connect through. Or not. Oh, uh, if that can't connect through, then that's, that's all for not. It doesn't even matter. The goal was to connect through, have it, uh, you know, mesh through, connect to this, because this connected through. So I don't know why this doesn't. I don't understand mesh in these locations. You know, I just want—I just wanted to use mesh as as, uh, as it should be used. I'm trying to be good, and unfortunately, the game does not want me to be. Holy moly! Again, I mean, I guess they are all super sprayers, so maybe that's why they are so good against this. But I figured this would have actually pushed substantially further than it has. Uh, so let's let's just give some eggs, you know. Again, we could use this to assault, but I'm trying to do this right. And to do this right, we definitely need, quote-unquote, backup, right? Uh, we definitely need to uh, drain this area, move on to the next, because there is no way, no way in hell we'd be able to uh, actually assault. Now, can we survive? Yes. Uh, but it's not just about survival, it's about actually doing it right uh, for this, this go. Don't get me wrong, I would just as happily do it. Eh, you know, probably have a lot of fun doing it quote-unquote wrong. Uh, because, we, again, we could have just sped to this emitter and started uh, upgrading it before probably there was a lot of, as, nearly as much AC over here. So, because I think we started with like 12 eggs, which is actually quite substantial. Oh, this AC is so, so much... Right now, the goal is just keep the cannons down, because, again, the more cannons that are down, the more that our creep, while deteriorating, is just deteriorating against AC and not deteriorating against the shots, you know? Any shot is a bad shot at the moment. Wow, that actually got built. It looks like it's actually touching it, which is wild to me. I should just do more blobs, maybe. But again, you know, the AC is taking over the back half, which was part of the goal. How is this doing? Again, this is just taking over, slowly but surely. That will win out in the end. But we move for a second, and we lose. Although, I think taking back here is actually a beneficial thing. It does allow our creep to build up substantially more, to a degree. You know, hit the back wall, and maybe bounce off the back wall and come back forward, create little waves. So, again, unfortunate for us, we are not going to be able to take to the shield, I don't think. Ooh, okay. What? I mean... I, I guess that's the only way that this area got power, but... Uh, we do need... Okay, so there is no actual connection other than this, right? So I guess what that does mean, that's how we're going to do it then. And I apologize, I am a fool and a half. Because we're just going to do what we did before, in reverse in essence, right? We're going to keep this down. Uh, we need to keep this pylon down for sure. So this pylon stays down. This moves across nice and easy like... I mean, do, just doing it this way to a save on uh, save on eggs and b. This way actually does generate us more power in the long run. Oh, uh, you know what? That's fine. That pylon is good where it is because I, I'm gonna I'm gonna deal with that a separate way. Actually, probably the easiest way. All right, we're up to the wall again, attacking the wall. Very stable can put our egg on the other side. No problems, because that's the rule. You know, we stick to the rules. And... Do, do, do. Two. One. Done. It is impressive. I didn't realize uh, super sprayers would be that effective. Last but not least... Really? Can a rock not do that? Is that not a thing that a rock does? Well, in that case, I'm just going to 
think I have two X. Because I did oh, or three X. There we go. Done and done. We have take it. Take it. No more energy. No more energy means no more shots. No more shots. Also, no more AC. No more AC. All the good things happen for us. Uh, we can take to the wall, which is actually surprising. I figured we wouldn't be able to take to the wall with all of the super units, but I guess it, it, the wall is slightly higher, so that's actually a really, really good thing for us. And yeah, their generation is going down. All the AC is pretty much gone from over here, which is fantastic. And let us grab this moving on up. Uh, again, I'm really sad that we can't bridge here. It seems like you should be able to, because again, it can bridge through over here. So I don't know what the difference is. And that's sad. So I would love to have just one path that goes all the way back. Uh, I would love to pop all eggs. We don't have... Wait! I get the orbitals. Weird. I didn't even look... I I mean, I never would have actually looked for orbitals, right? I mean, it's not like I can do anything with them. Uh, but apparently I can. So I can rain? Yeah, I can actually rain. So I can be like, oh man. It would be terrible if rain happened here. And it does. Weird. I mean, I'm not going to use it on myself, of course, but I guess they could. Or I could. You know, just an honor, be like, yeah, they would probably use a rain right here right now, you know. And while that kind of goes for the code, I don't quite think I'm up to that far yet. Alright, so how much AC crafting do they have over here? Oh my god, their base has no defense whatsoever. Like, none. I mean, yeah, if, if we were to blob over, er, egg over, I mean, I guess you would need to have a lot of land to have the power to hold right here against the wall against all of that. I mean, that is reckless hate right there. Uh, but, I mean, we, we kind of do. Uh, because that's what these 56, 58 uh, rocks are for, our final assault, right? We want to destroy anything with an urn. Get it out of here. I mean, realistically, we could destroy these with urns as well. Uh, because they're rocks, you know, they're falling from orbit. I, mean, I would treat them slightly separately. But I don't really care that this is getting shot. You know, uh, I do kind of want these dead. Just because, you know, I'm, they're, they're, they're in our land at this point, you know. So let's, let's just be a little rude. Just a wee little bit. That's better. That's better. Uh, mesh up to the wall. And yeah, the AC. Alright, so how is this doing? Okay, so our creep is clearly... At, well, this is just going to fall, right? That's going to happen. But this one is very easily broken, right? Because our creep is not only taller than it, but it's also deeper than it, too. You know, we... We go, we go up and down at a pretty good tick, so yeah, we can, we can very easily just get into here, which is gonna be really, really bad for them, because even though they have a defensive line, we have the capability just to, just to go on three, you know, nice and easy, and that's actually pushing in, because they're trying to shoot my little, uh, my little walking bubble, but they're gonna lose their, uh, their MRF real, real soon. And that's that is not going to go well for them. Uh, losing that MRF is going to be a very bad thing, of course. Uh, and this also gives me like just a little breather right here. We're just gonna we're just gonna build up while we're in the shield because it's like holding back everything, and that's just gonna let us like spill out and have just that just that breathing. Room. We now have a nice solid amount of creep backup creep, right? Because we are we are in no man's land, you know we were just sort of uh, moving along, but we want to we wanna take their breeder, right? Get, get that not breeding anymore. If we can, two seconds, yeah, we got the top side. We can work towards the bottom. The bottom is going to start breeding, unfortunately. But we cut out a lot of AC production right there as well. So, already, already feeling so good about this last, uh, this last stand. 
if you will. I do need to hold this though. The AC cometh to taketh. Alright, alright, alright. This works for two reasons. One, we are cutting off their AC production, and two, we're actually working on cutting off their Ooh, their power. Yes, so the power has been cut. Unfortunately, they are in the process of rebuilding it. They did get some AC rebuilt, but I think the AC of this area has been fairly destroyed. Uh, and even though they might get some power in shortly, uh, I think I'm able to hold them. So yeah, that this has this has fallen uh, very simply. Okay. Easy peasy. Now, what is this mesh here for? Does it go down? It doesn't go down. It's just like a splotch of mesh. Which is very weird to me. Very weird. I do not understand. Uh, I mean, it goes this way. Does it go over the edge? Is, can we connect up to, like, over here somewhere? Like... If we did this, is this actually a back way in kind of thing? Like a secret, a secret pathway somehow? I don't know. Uh, doesn't really look like it's going onto the wall, so I don't understand this mesh. I was just checking. You never know. You never know. And yeah, now we have finally made it to their last stand. Oh my, oh my. How does the rest of the map look? Did we finally take this? We did finally take this. That is glorious. This is all ours, of course. Uh, they're doing grand over here. No problems whatsoever. But, yeah, we've taken... We've taken uh, We've taken their lands. We've taken their things. Uh, they have very little AC left. And we actually want to push through that, of course. And, yeah, again, this is, this is the next step, right? The next step is the... Uh, the rock explosion. So that is literally just everything must go, right? Uh, toss in way more rocks than we need. And just boom. Just get rid of those mortars that are earned. That is the biggest thing possible. We even got rid of a shield that was earned, which is huge because now... Uh, we're able to get that much closer. Actually, I think I, I think I do want to get rid of all those shields, right? So if we can get rid of you, 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 you. Oh no, it goes for a shields like last, doesn't it? Yeah. But now we have their frontline shields already down. Feels pretty good. We did use a ton of rocks, and that's what we had the rocks for. You know, this is what I wanted to really use the rocks for. We could egg in. I mean, again, we are stable here, so I'm just going to... Oh wait, those are all those are all shields. I'm a fool. We can't just dig in. It's okay. We'll start destroying shields and then the eggs shall pop. Although I think I just wasted them all because all the snipers shot them. Oh, I feel so bad. I literally messed up all of my eggs. I should have destroyed the shields first. Uh, but we are able to to basically hold here, especially now that their mortar defenses have been taken care of. Oh. It is so good. How much time is left on this shield? Whoa, might be easier to see from this side. Maybe not. Okay, so the shield is down to the bare minimums. So that feels pretty good to me. Uh, you know what? Blobs, why not? They, they have the snipers, but you know what? They're not going to have them for very long. Right? So we'll hold this here. We'll keep the shield down, and then we'll, we will eliminate them, of course. Oh, I think. Yeah, that is, uh... That is a bad time. We are in their lands. Oh, my. And I think with that, we're going to go shield hopping first, right? Uh, because I don't really care about too much, it's the fact that their shields are holding back the regular creep, right? I mean, 
anything can hold. We can't. Nothing can stop us. We can go straight for the base. It's perfectly fine. But that's not what this. This is, this is about a step-by-step -step guide to just utter destruction. And yeah, I, I want the creep to flow. I definitely don't want the creep to to feel limited in any way, shape, or form. So we definitely need to just get in here and do our thing. So let's get rid of as many shields as possible at the front lines. Hopefully the creep will be able to sustain itself at the front lines. And once it can, uh, we're just golden, right? So every, every shield that falls just lets our creep flow in more and more. That is, in essence, our goal. And it doesn't look like it is. It looks like it is being fairly, fairly well uh, pushed away. And I don't like that. Maybe we do have to go on a bit of a hunt, right? So maybe that's what I will do. We will we will hunt down first the urn shields, right? Because then that makes the uh, the regular shields that much smaller, in essence. Uh, they are pushing back the main wave, though. But we're in here. We're doing our thing. It's also uh, eliminating the AC in here, which of course will always be a good thing. So every urn shield, though, that goes down is just not gonna come back. Uh, ooh, that's a nice little corner. And we'll come up here, just work through the urn shields in the back, and then we'll come back to the front lines, which should allow our main force to uh, to do some work. Uh, the other thing we can also do is work on the AC itself. Again, if, I mean, if we take this, this is a pretty huge uh, hit to their production, which will always be good to do, of course. We don't want them uh, breeding away, so get some shields down, get this uh, well-established for ourselves. Yeah, that feels pretty good, especially as we take out the shields here, that sort of gives us a home. Ooh. Just make this nice and large. Wow, that's... I'm surprised they held that out. And there we go. I just want to hold this for the next breeding cycle. Honestly, that's it. Uh, after that, I'm good with letting it go. Because, again, we, ha we have our... Uh, I didn't even hold it for the next breeding cycle. Uh, that's pretty terrible. Alright, let's head back. Like I said, I want to get this one last uh, shield. Or super shield, I should say. And then we're going to work on pushing in again. Right? So this super shield must go... There we go. Feels pretty good when the super shields go. And again, I mean, we have so much uh, power that they, they, they can't do anything. Uh, they, we are pushing in through the shield again, which is good. The goal is to start destroying the shields so the creep maintains itself. As long as the creep can come in by itself, that's all that matters. Uh, and if the creep can come in and hold an area where a shield was, that also is all that matters. Because then it's not getting pushed back, and, you know, everyone everyone's just happy. Everyone is just happy. So, looks like we're in. Uh, again, oh no, you were supposed to kill that. There we go. It's all about making sure our main creep is good. And it is, I think. I think it... No? Now the AC is pushing it back. I am very surprised the AC is pushing it back this hard. How much AC is in here? I mean, I guess that is a fair bit, but I mean... Right, you know, does this... I guess this mesh is to show us that we can mesh around, to mesh up here, to mesh in. Because will this actually go through and work? I mean, let's see, I guess. That probably would have made more sense earlier. But we shall see. Alright, we're good there. Still holding on. I did want... My goal was to sort of take this left corner, right? Because there's nothing really to stop us once we're there. Uh, like, just take this, take this, go all the way to the left, have the main creep just come in, and then we would be just perfect, right? It would be perfection. Hold this entire corner. Cut out all the AC make this a creep stronghold it has to assault us on the one side which always good hold your walls hold your edges uh no more mortars and if we can just hold this i'll be very very happy 
Let's see, is the creep actually going up? It is! Oh, it is actually going up. Oh, see? For some reason, because I, I it didn't work earlier, that was my fault. And that was, that was stupidity of me. You know? I, I did not take it seriously enough. Beautiful. All these mortars are gone. And it does look like the creep is now stable. Uh, we've taken another... Uh... Oh, no, no, don't destroy the base. Blobs, you're getting ahead of yourselves. Come on. So, it looks like... Yeah, okay. We, we've fully, fully uh, taken the land where the creep is holding no problem. It doesn't even need us to push really anymore for the AC to uh, not be handled. So, and I guess the next step would be to do the same on the opposite side, right? So we do want to do that. Ooh, let's get rid of this super shield. We'll go for super shield areas. Oh, man, the AC is, like, to the point where it's, like, done. <laughs> so even better still. Oh, and they have no red on. I didn't even... Oh, that's depressing. I thought they had an infinite red on supply. Interesting. I was not expecting that. Well, then. I mean, if that's the case, let's just uh, do this instead. Because uh, they do seem to have basically an infinite energy supply, right? With uh, with all of that. A red on, not so much, though. Ooh, don't charge that. Oh, yep, we want to. Right, we're good. Hold it. I think you uh, can see what I'm doing here. We're, we're just moving along, trying to establish just a line. I know we are going to destroy their factory, but you know what? That's kind of okay right now. Uh, the entire key right now is just get rid of that right there. And that is what we wanted to do, right? They run out of power so very quickly because they're earned up. And yeah, now they... They lost their power. No more shots. Oh. Now it's like, you know, just beating up little... Little weak little things. I mean, they can't do anything about it now. And that was the only thing holding us back. Oh, no. <laughs> so much power and nowhere for it to go. Oh, it's a shame. And look at that. The mesh did make it in. Yay! You can go that way that way it's a happy time so this was just a fun little just a fun little way to do it you know uh, again if I was going super serious we probably could have done this in you know like five or ten minutes something like that right and you know maybe maybe I'll try to do it like that another day uh, maybe it'll be bonus I don't know uh, we shall see but for now step one is just this there. Ooh, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. You're done. And that is a whole lot of urns that have been destroyed. Oh my, oh my. Beautiful. Glorious. Objective obtained. Thank you so much for joining me. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, any, all, any and all that good stuff. Uh, you know what? Just for the sake of the world, we're, we're just gonna, we're just gonna bring it back. There we go. Looks like fun. Uh, and there we have it. That is the end of the final stand. Thank you so much for joining me again. Maybe there'll be a bonus video. I don't know. I'll have to decide. Uh, yeah, see, look at that. Five minutes. So this is definitely one that you can sort of tease like that. Uh, but yeah, catch you later. Take care. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. <laughs>